Hello Libras, this is Guy Intuitive. Please like, share and subscribe. This is Guy Intuitive. This is your readings for November, this month for November. If you're returning, hi, nice to see you. If you're new here, please like, share and subscribe and stay tuned. You'll love it here. Libras, I'm t I titled your, your reading, Si Esta Loco, because... Yes, this is crazy, you know. <laughs> God's plan, Libra. God's plan. They regret it now, okay? They regret it now. Libras, this month, like, share, scope your season. Mm. There's somebody, it could be a fire sign, but I feel like there's a female Libra here with the Empress underneath the deck. First of all, let's talk about it. You... I feel like this month you could be um buying yourself um new clothes like you know you doing yourself up you know you're getting done up doing your hair you're changing your hair getting your nails done you buying new clothes buying new music putting yourself putting yourself onto new music you may meet an Aquarius you may you may vibe a lot there may be an Aquarius that likes um your your avant garde energy like your your avant-garde interests yeah but libras there could be like a female here somebody is jealous libra first of all there's a somebody is jealous of you libra this person is jealous and it's cr the things that are je they're jealous of it's crazy it's really crazy somebody here I feel like somebody here tried to um first of all somebody went to a witch or a wizard right somebody here went i feel like somebody went to a witch or a wizard so they went to this person they went to a fake practitioner you may need to check out the earth sign weekend reading could have happened this weekend of the halloween somebody went to a fake practitioner libra right and guess who's the reason why they're going there you're the reason libra you so this person went out of their way and they went to this person this fake practitioner they went there because they're trying to get you killed they wanted to kill you or they wanted to like put a curse on you or something but this curse is like some supposed to like destroy you or in a, in a way you know what i'm saying it's supposed to affect you badly like tower moment like everything should be falling apart maybe you're even supposed to die in an accident or something beloved in a building i don't know if you heard that hood but you could have you were supposed to die in an accident somebody here who child libra child child but libras 313 could be significant which area code is that you may be from there but i feel like libra so this person went there. Oh my gosh, I'm, I'm telling you this, this. I'm still channeling. I haven't pulled any deck. So this person went to um, this practitioner and this practitioner did what they were paid for, but it didn't work because they fake. It's a fake practitioner. So this person went there and it didn't work. So now they returned back. <laughs> so they returned back after they like, because they wasted their money. They spent a lot of money. Going, they paid this practitioner to do this curse on you, to like stagnate you. I feel like somebody, so this woman, oh my God, let me wait. This, so this, it's a woman. So this woman went back they mad they're angry it didn't work so i feel like this person it may bounce back to them or something that leap that august that october reading god's plan it was it relates to this reading in a way i need to go back i don't remember what was happening there um but so this person that's the message Somebody went to a fake practitioner in you. Somebody is like jealous, Libra, of you. Okay? I also feel like somebody is jealous of your eyeballs. <laughs> somebody is like jealous of your eyeballs. Your eyes. You may have like, like big eyes or something. Like you have like beautiful eyes. You may have um, Scorpio as your rising. 
and Jupiter there. You may have Jupiter in your first house, Jupiter somewhere. Which house rules the eyes? Scorpio, you may have Jupiter in your eighth house. Or your first house in Scorpio, Jupiter in Scorpio. But somebody is like jealous of your eyes. You have big eyes, like you may have like big eyes, or you have like these unique eyes. I feel like your eyes make you look um foreign, like you look foreign, like you don't look like you're from your family or something, like you don't look like you're from your race. That's what I'm also getting. I feel like your eyes are too unique for your race or for your in your family i also feel like somebody's like <laughs> jealous of your visions like somebody's jealous of your gifts what you possess i feel like what what this person is jealous of they can't take it from you it's abstract you can't take away something that is abstract because you can't touch it you can't you can feel it but you can't touch it you can't even see it some of it some of it you can witness like maybe your talents you're a talented um, fashion designer. You're a talented um, artist or something. Like you have gifts. You have a talent that this person is jealous of. They go into these fake practitioners to basically deteriorate your powers or some, your gifts or something. Somebody wants your gifts. Somebody tried. But I also feel like somebody here, there's a woman who tried. There's a lot of scenarios. Oh my gosh. And there's a lot of channeling. So I guess half of your reading will be like channeled. It won't be like tarot. So I feel like too, Libra, there's a woman here who tried. I feel like somebody here made a wrong sacrifice too. That's another thing. Like I'm talking about a human sacrifice. Somebody killed a wrong person. <laughs> I mean, it's not funny. It's not funny. It's not funny. But I feel like... This person, I feel like too, somebody here that was doing like this ritual, I feel like they forgot something during the ritual. They forgot to do something during the ritual. I feel like that's why it didn't work. I feel like too, you could have broken a spell. I feel like maybe like you, 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 you can feel when somebody's like cursing you. So you, you did like a salt bath or something, like some bath. Or you went to the ocean, you went to the river, you like you went to the, to the sea, you went to the river or something and you got a cleansing or you burnt some sage. I feel like you, this person, they forgot something during the ritual and the ritual was not complete. So now this person has a price to pay. So it could be death. So it could be their life. It will cost them their life. Because I feel like this was a very serious ritual. It involves death. So it's either you or them. So if they fail killing you, to, if they fail to kill you, they will die. So this person failed to do something during the ritual. It's just one more thing that they were supposed to do. They forgot about it. And bam, Libra, bam. This person is going to suffer. They're going to pay God's plan. They regret it now. Si esta loco. Okay, some of y'all, y'all could be um Spanish, Latin, Dominican. Like y'all speak Latin, you speak Spanish. But I feel like somebody here tried to sacrifice. Um, okay, somebody tried to also kill their husband. Okay, so they had a wealthy. They tried to sacrifice a king of pentacles. So this man is a king of pentacles. He's wealthy. He has money, but. He was intelligent, okay? He didn't include this woman on the will. So when he died and the will came out, she received nothing. And she, it's like now, so now she has a price to pay because she killed somebody. So now she's she basically, she sold her soul. So now she's going to hell for nothing it's like she's gonna go to hell for nothing because she didn't benefit anything it's like going down for for nothing like she didn't benefit anything from what she was doing she failed this woman and i feel like the husband is happy she's he's watching her from from above he's watching her and he's happy that he didn't put her on the will because 
he knew that this bitch was crying me, that he, for, just in case for something like this happens, and it happens. So Libra, that could be happening to you or someone around you, maybe your brother, your sister, your father or something, your uncle, but, or that's, so that's the scenario. And Libra, if you're the female, you're trying to kill somebody for, it's not going to work, baby. It's not going to work. If you're a comic, you're watching, like you're a cross-watcher, you're not a Libra. And you're doing this to a Libra, mm -mm, honey, like you need to stop. Like you need to sit down. Like you need to sit at this point. Like give it up. It's Libra. You, they win and you lose. I feel like to somebody here, they don't understand astrology. Libra, you rule the scales. You rule justice, fairness. So I feel like whenever somebody tries to do you something grimy against you, it's, it's the, the karma is, is intense. The karma is immense. But I feel like Libra's too here with the Queen of Swords. I feel like um <clears throat> I feel like too y'all could be um gaining clear skin this month. I feel like your skin could be clearing. Um I feel like maybe you could be um detoxing for some of you. I feel like for some of you y'all could be drinking a lot of water. Um I also feel like this month for some of you, um as I said, like you're happy, you're glowing this month, like you you transforming yourself your your wardrobe your hair your nails your haircut some of my nails could be getting like a new haircut you could be shaving your beard for some of you you have beard you could be shaving your beard it may make you will look younger if you do that you make you look younger 10 10 could be significant that's lottery energy you need to watch the lottery you i mean oh watch the lottery so i feel like yeah, you need to watch the lottery. I don't know. But I feel like for some of you, you need, I was about to say, you need to play the lottery. I don't know if there's a movie called The Lottery or Lottery. So you need to watch that movie this month. Um, also, yeah, jackpot energy, the wheel of fortune. Like, you're very fortunate this month, Libra. Like, this is you, Libra, the queen of swords. Like, <laughs> they love it in the building. So, um, I feel like um, you could be, yeah, so there's the wheel of fortune. I feel like changes, cycles, like, yeah, you're changing your wardrobe. You could be changing your room for some of you, like your environment, like you're just changing everything. You're just transforming Scorpio energy, Scorpio season. For some of you, you could be changing your friends, like legit. You could be changing your friends for some of you. Because I feel like, I mean, you outgrow this. I feel like they don't, they don't match who you are. Or yeah, I feel like they, they, you could be, um, there's no passion. Like there's no fire. I feel like the fire is like gone. Like that, that spark of friendship, it's gone. I feel like you want something new and fresh with the page of cups, like in the fourth pentacles. I feel like these people are greedy. They, they, they're needy. I feel like you could have dropped somebody who was like greedy and needy. Like this person, they needy. They want you all to themselves. I feel like you can't even have friends. It's like, I can't even have friends? Like, what? I can't even have friends? I feel like you could have been dating somebody here that didn't like your friends. Like, they don't even have a reason. They don't have a good reason, but they don't like your friend. <laughs> so I feel like you could have dropped them. Like, uh-uh, you, you're, you're being a bitch. You're a bitch. I feel like two Libras, people could be could be speaking your mind a lot this month. People feel like you're a bitch. Yeah. Yeah. I'm that bitch. You, you, you want to call me a bitch? Tell them, Libra, next time you call me a bitch, don't forget to put bad in front. Because that's what I am. Bad bitch. Okay? Okay? Libras, you need to... You need to gain... You need to be confident. Okay? You can't let anybody, like, talk shit talk you down like you need to be confident libras could be celebrating your birthday this month on the 10th of november yeah the emperor so it could be your father your father could be born on the 10th of november you're celebrating your father's birthday i feel like to your father you could be on your father's will. For some of you, your father may have been assassinated. I feel like if your father passed away and they left a lot of money, they were like wealthy and rich. It's likely they were murdered by the wife. Okay. 
And if the wife didn't get anything, listen, beloved in the building, beloved in the building, Libra. I feel like Libra is if, right? You are, I feel like your father passed away and they left a lot of money and the woman didn't get nothing. The wife, that's a confirmation. She murdered, she killed him. She sacrificed him. She killed him and she didn't get nothing in, in the end. But I feel like it could be um changing to like your positions at work. Maybe you're like elevating um I feel like you're to management, you're elevating to management. I feel like you're the employee of the month. I feel like you're you're being promoted this month, Libra, November, you're getting a promotion. Congratulations. I don't know, you could be like in a very put you could be like put in a very authoritative position. Yeah. So it could be like management or something, supervisor. Yeah, the full card. Some brand new beginnings, fresh new beginnings. Yeah, so I feel like it could be um leading. um. So yeah, you could be management, like you're managing like new employees or people that are like low level or something. But you are in position, you're being, pro being prostrated to a, a position of authority. Uh, Libras, I only like pulled like four cards and I already said a lot. Like we are uh, 16 minutes in, 16.52, 7, 7, lottery energy, Libra energy, beloved in a building, the Empress in reverse. Yeah, here's this female. She is like jealous as fuck, mad as fuck. She's like perturbed. That she didn't get what she wanted. Yeah, the magician in reverse. It didn't work. And she, she's having sleepless nights with the nine of swords. She, she's having anxiety. She can't even speak with the king of swords. Like, the truth is like burning her inside. The truth is burning her inside. She could be like waking up at night, like randomly at 3 a.m. Because she's having nightmares. Yeah, three of cups, beloved, in the building. She's waking up at three in the morning. Three in the morning, bitch. Like, <laughs> but I feel like that's what you get. That's what you get, right? That's the price you pay. Everything got a price, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying, Libra? Everything got a price, you know, man? So for some of you, I don't know, you could be a madame. You could be a madam for some of you. Yeah, I feel like this month you're coming into wealth. I feel like you're getting, um, could be like receiving an inheritance or you're winning a lottery, but there's a, there's a huge influx, influx of wealth that is coming, influx of money that is coming. Five of Swords, Page of Swords. Yeah, this person was not included in the will, but I feel like with the Page of Swords, I feel like something here was done, like your father... Your father could have been an Aries or a Cancer. An Aries or a Cancer, right? But I feel like... Or Scorpio. But I feel like, yeah, something here was done. Um, I feel like here with the Five of Swords, you're having the last laugh. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, I feel like you, you could be like laughing. I don't know, you're laughing here at somebody because they failed. Yeah, you're laughing at this woman. So that's your reading. Libras, please like, share, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time.